If you want to learn UX design, you're at the right place. Welcome to the world's easiest UX design crash course. Let's go. What is UX? UX or user experience is how people feel when they use a product, whether it's a website, app, or even a physical object. It's not about how something works, it's about how easy, smooth, and enjoyable it is to use. UX versus UI. What's the difference? People often mix up UX, which is user experience, and UI, which is user interface, but they're not the same thing. UX is the feeling users get when they use a product. UI is the look of a product, including colors, buttons, typography, and other visual elements. The one rule that makes any design work. Clarity wins. If users don't instantly understand what they're looking at, they won't engage. A design should make its purpose obvious. Users don't want to figure things out. They expect designs to be intuitive and follow familiar patterns. A visually stunning design that confuses people is ineffective, but a clear, simple and guiding design ensures engagement and success. Understanding users. How to think like a user even if you're not one. Users aren't designers. They just want to get things done fast. They won't read everything and don't care about fancy animations or expect familiar patterns all the time. If they can't find what they need in seconds, they'll leave. So how do you get into that mindset. Always assume they're in a hurry. Make key actions obvious, preventing errors or make them easy to undo. And most importantly, don't frustrate them. Because even if something works, a bad experience will drive them away. The fastest way to create a user persona. To design for real users, start by creating a quick persona. Answer five key questions. Who is your user? What do they want? What's stopping them? How do they behave? And what motivates them? Turn it into a simple persona like Sarah, a 28-year-old freelance designer looking for quick UX tips but frustrated by complex tutorials. Would Sarah find this video easy? Would it solve a problem quickly? If not, tweak it. User research without the boring stuff. User research doesn't have to be boring or time-consuming. Spy on real users through reviews and social media complaints. Do quick and informal tests like asking a friend what they think your design does. Watch people interact with your product and note where they struggle. Always ask the magic question, what almost made you leave? If multiple users get stuck on the same thing, fix it. Simple UX design principles. The three second rule, making users stay. A good UX grabs attention in three seconds or less. If a total stranger can't tell what your product does in three seconds, simplify it. Clarity over creativity. Clarity beats creativity all the time. Use plain language, familiar layouts and obvious actions. The power of consistency. Consistency is key. When users don't have to relearn anything, they'll move faster and trust your design. Navigation and interaction. UX Navigation 101. Stop confusing your users. Navigation should be effortless. Follow the three-click rule. Users should reach what they need in three clicks or less. Keep labels clear and avoid hidden buttons. Button links and clickable things. Use buttons for actions and links for navigation. Make clickable elements obvious, use clear button text and ensure users get feedback when they click. Micro interactions, small touches, big impact. Micro interactions like button animations and success messages make UX feel more intuitive and engaging. They provide instant feedback, making actions feel smooth and natural. Wireframing and prototyping. How to sketch a wireframe in five minutes? Want a fast wireframe? Start with a simple box. Add key sections like header, content, and footer and use basic shapes. The best thing about making a wireframe is you don't need complicated tools. Just use a paper and pen and keep it minimal. No colors, just structure. The fastest way to make a usable prototype. Turn this wireframe into a prototype using Figma. Add clickable hotspots and test it yourself before sharing feedback. If you want to learn how to convert a wireframe into a prototype, watch this complete video where we turn a simple wireframe into a complete prototype of a complete productivity tracker SaaS application. Testing without testing. Quick tricks to validate UX. Number one, the blink test. When you look at your UI, can you tell what it does in three seconds? Number two, the click count rule. Is the process too complex? And number three, the five-year-old test. Will the five-year-old get what your UI does instantly? Real-world application. UX for websites and apps. What's the difference? Websites and apps require different approaches. Websites are click-based with menus and apps rely on taps. Apps need to be faster and work offline, while websites must load quickly and access across devices. The UX checklist for any design. Before launching, check for clarity, ease of navigation, accessibility, feedback, and mobile friendliness. A great UX isn't about looking good, it's about making everything feel effortless. Fixing bad UX. Common mistakes and how to avoid them. Keep it simple and your users will stick around. Here are some common mistakes and how to fix them. If you have a confusing navigation with too many options or hidden menus, fix it. Keep the navigation simple, clear, and consistent. If you have slow load times, users will leave. Fix it. Optimize images, minimize animations, and improve 
improve performance. Unclear call to action buttons? Fix it. Use action driven texts like get your free guide instead of submit. Poor mobile experience with buttons too small or hard to scroll? Fix it. Make everything tab friendly and responsive. If users get a lack of feedback after a button click with no response to tell if their request is processing or not? Fix it. Use loading indicators, success messages and animations and want to be good at UX design? Fix it. Subscribe to Vira and follow for more. The greatest takeaway you can take is good UX design removes frustration, tests, tweaks and simplifies. And I will see you in the next video.